Hey guys, Dr. Davin Lim, board certified laser dermatologist. Today we'll be talking about what's the best platform for advice on skincare, skincare needs and procedures. Um, as you know, I've been doing this for the last, what, two, two and a half years and the channel's growing and it's great. But as you YouTubers would know, or content creators, um, to get a video on YouTube is actually really difficult because you've got to remember, you've got to film, uh, so you've got to film the procedure, you've got to film yourself with this, then you've got to edit everything, um, then, so you've got to go to different software, download, um, edit, uh, patient confidentiality, make sure they're, they're edited, and then after that, put in all the title tags, information, uh, compress it, and then actually write the um, keyword summary in regards to YouTube, upload it on YouTube, do a specific tile, and then upload that. Um, make sure your cards are intact, your endnotes are intact, and then you release it to YouTube. And then you get yourself a really good production video. But that, that whole process takes hours, hours and literally hours. And um, look, there's a lot of politics behind this, and this is the truth. I'm working in the group practice, so which means I can't be favoured um, to have actually a person videoing me or an editor. I have to do it all by myself. And yes, I do see patients, I do research, I do the whole lot, but at the end of the day, I still have to do my YouTube videos. So, which leads me on to the topic. Um, I found this thing called uh, Instagram. Yeah, Instagram, yeah. So I found something called Instagram about two years ago started uploading a few times and I didn't take it seriously until about uh, a month ago yeah so that's when I discovered something called Instagram stories so now I didn't realize that you can upload stories you can upload this you can upload videos for up to one minute so for example if I was going to do a review I can do a review on a retinoid uh, on Instagram within one minute and give you all the information that you need to know so if you go down here and have a look at my videos on um, reviews you can see that I'm posting about two to three times per day. So which means instead of actually waiting for these long videos, which by all means is more comprehensive than the uh, videos on Instagram, um, at least I don't have to do all that editing process. I can just flick on my camera and do something like this. Ready? Here we go. Aspect Doctor. So now I'm reviewing Aspect Doctor in the Instagram um, Skin Lab episode three. Aspect Doctor is a high-end um, retinol, so it contains retinol, also contains lactic acid, which can be anti-inflammatory, but it also helps with the absorption of retinol, because retinol needs to be converted from retinol to, retin to a retinoid for it to actually be active. It also contains anti-inflammatories, willow bug extract, um, but the price is a lot more compared to, let's say, The Ordinary, which I did a review on just uh, last week. So you're looking at uh, around $11 and $118. So you're looking at 10 times the difference. Is it going to give you 10 times the value? No, it's not. You make the decision. Cheers. See, that's what I can do on Instagram. Um, you get the exact um, stuff with no fluff uh, without me editing the whole lot. Because remember, YouTube videos as well, they want us to go way over three, four minutes. Otherwise, we don't get rated at all. So that's why we have to actually extend our, you see all the good YouTubers extend it to about five minutes uh, because otherwise um, YouTube penalizes that because for everyone who actually puts ads on their uh, YouTube accounts, they want that time. And you can see I don't um, you know, monetize mine because I find it really irritating uh, to actually go through and have an ad midway. So yeah, uh, for now, channels non-monetize at all at YouTube. And same with Instagram. But the great thing about Instagram, as you can see, um, I can do so many posts and I can get straight to the point without any uh, BS. And then you can read it, you can flick it. If, it's not, if that doesn't interest you, if acne scarring doesn't interest you, if it's the latest subcision or the latest laser I use doesn't interest you, certainly you can just flick past that and go straight to your skincare. Skincare doesn't interest you and you're more interested in, for example, facelift procedures or um, energy devices, whatever, whatever is new, whether it be thermage, cool sculpting, um, you know, name it, it's there. Microneedling, you know, even little hints on how to uh, skin needle without actually trolling through all my videos. It's all arranged in these little tile formats uh, on, um, on Instagram. 
And if something new comes up, guess what I do? I just take one of the videos down um, and then just put up the newest one up instead of YouTube got to go through the whole process of editing again. So that's why I say it's, it's actually a very good platform for the most amount of information you want, especially when it comes to dermatology because in dermatology, all you need is that short one to two minute segment or you need a short synopsis on that particular procedure. Um, however, I'm telling you this, um, I'm still not gonna give up on YouTube because YouTube is still a very good platform for being precise and being exact to cover the whole topic. For example, I cannot cover a topic of acne scarring, right, on, on, um, on Instagram, absolutely not. I can't even cover even one, like one hundredth of the entire topic on a one minute tile, it's impossible. I can't even cover subcision on, uh, on a one minute um, video, it's impossible. I can just show you just, you know, 60 seconds worth of, 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 of subcision or um, how I do uh, Botox for auxiliary hyperhidrosis or sweating. Um, but it's a really good way of watching that one minute video. Uh, and you can just flick through all the different topics which I cover because it's a broad top, it's a broad area. Plus you get all those pretty pictures and quotes and all that sort of stuff about beauty and inspirational, I guess, for you guys as well and myself. So guys, please hop over to Instagram. Um, this YouTube channel still is growing. I'm not gonna give up. Um, and it's, I'm just gonna keep uploading every single week as I do, uh, but put more better content into this. Uh, you, Instagram, by the way, has got this thing called IGTV. So as you know, you hold things vertically. So now I'm uploading on that as well. So I'm uploading YouTube. I've got to reformat my videos for Instagram TV. And I'm doing lots of um, one minute quick videos on how to look after your skin. So um, all my, as you know, all, all my videos, like I said, they're not sponsored. So I don't go, well, you gotta buy this product or whatever. I don't do any product endorsements. I just tell it like it is. I just read out the label. I tell you what it is because remember, skincare is, should be objective. So it should be objectively measured. Yeah, so scientifically objective, but subjective in how you feel. So guys, please uh, comment down below, uh, but please, uh, yeah, uh, what do they call it? Not subscribe, follow, is it follow? Yeah, follow, follow me on Instagram because if you go on the gram, you're getting a lot more uh, information. And like I said, if you don't like the tile, flick to the next one. Okay guys, please subscribe to YouTube and I'll see you on Instagram. Uh, and the other thing as well with Instagram, I can actually interact with you guys a lot easier. Uh, on YouTube, I got uh, 43 million views. How in the hell am I going to interact with 43 million viewers? Um, I mean, you know, it's 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 impossible. It's one of me. 43 million views. Uh -uh, it's not going to happen. But on Instagram, sure, you can put your comments below, and I'll try my best to understand uh, to understand to answer. But once again, you've got to realize it's one of me. I'm doing the whole lot. Uh, unlike others who have uh, people answer their um, Instagram uh, questions, I answer every single YouTube and Instagram question, okay? So it's just one of me. So if, if there is, please don't DM me because uh, honestly I get 100 emails and I've got to reply to about 200. So I've got 300 messages every single day. You multiply that seven, that's 2,000 things which I've got to reply to on top of doing my daily work. Okay guys, so thanks for understanding and I'll see you uh, next week. Bye.